put down your laptop and put down your phone. Go outside and play and get out of this dark home. There are people out there in the real world you know, so go get to know your fellow kin, your fellow man, your fellow bro. Technology is killing our creativity, social media decaying our society. We play first person shooters and role playing games, while forgetting about the real world beyond our computer screen and usernames. We don't interact with each other. Just type our thoughts on a keyboard while hiding behind our profile pictures of something absurd. Your parents scream out that your eyes will turn square. Technology is killing us, making us robotic, closing us off from society and the public. Politicians show that they care, companies and countries block sites. Hang on a minute, this doesn't seem right. I've never been further than France or Germany, but my eyes have travelled across different lands and different seas. I've never been to Africa or read any of their books, but I can tell you each one of its country's political looks. I've never been to Ukraine, but been watching it since September, hearing it from the people, not the mass-controlled media. Fucking travel keeps me away for days, too skint to go out and play. My mates are off living their own lives, thank goodness for Facebook, or else I'd be an acquaintance in their eyes. I listen to bands that you wouldn't know. I've seen art from unknown artists better than Van Gogh, seen sportsmen that have never been given a go. And I've heard people's perspectives that would make your mind explode. I know more about the seas, different galaxies and countries from normal people's perspectives, not edited or blacklisted. I've talked to people from all over the world about their goals and projects, how to use the technology that we hold to better their lives and the future of their kids. Technology takes us away from the X Factor winners, the TV soaps and the living room dinners. It takes us away from the politically controlled mass accepted media. There isn't just one person on our screen telling us what to do, how to think and how to be. We can choose our own channel or make it ourselves. Stuff the daily newspapers and the TV news shows. With this technology we can find the truth and let us comment, share and know. No longer are we a slave to the political machine, but willing slaves to technology that screws up their schemes. With things like Wikipedia and WikiLeaks, politicians scream and weep. With this technology that is in our hands, we can reshape this screwed up land. The economy is crashing and money is falling, but through this technology our future is calling. Harness the power of what is in your hand. A millennium's worth of knowledge is at your command. Your phone can take you to the deepest, darkest depths of the seas, to the firstest galaxies and unexplored countries. From the smallest of molecules to the largest of mountains, nothing can stop you from utilizing you. Once your parents have brought you up in this society, you can look at others and see what makes them free. Don't be led down the path of democracy or communism, but look through the veil to witness the lives of others. Through technology we can evolve ourselves, make our mind quicker, our bodies stronger, print new organs and have prosthetic limbs that sense and feel. Clone and grow meat for the future of our world. Don't throw it away because of other people's second-hand views and mass media politically controlled news. Just remember to get out there and talk about what you've seen. Let us evolve together through this bureaucracy. Next time they tell you to put down your phone and to go outside and play from your dark home where people will bully, pick on you to ignore or stare down and try to control you. This happens in the real world, it happens in the cyber, unfortunately it is part of society. Utilise this technology that's in your hands, look after your future and damn the man. We can make money from our phones and laptops, we are the next generation will be on top. But have you seen the video of the monkey scratching its ass and then sniffing its finger? Hilarious and definitely worth watching and sharing.